Hey, Sausage Sleuths, it's me, your slipperiest Sausage Sleuth, Joe. Welcome back to Nancy Drew, The Haunted Carousel. I was just checking my Outlook Express on my Windows 95, and there's a few things that I must do today, including this one. <laughs> I forgot about all, literally all of these. Look for the third, yeah, the third roll. We just don't know. All I know is that Joy is the best character. I think, I think what happened is a lot of people, from what I've heard, didn't like Joy when they were kids playing this game, but then they grew up and they realized they are Joy, and now they relate to her. That's the kind of the vibe that I'm getting. I really do need to get this work done. Oh, sorry. Right. Sorry. See, that's all of us. We don't have time. We're too busy. We're overworked, underpaid. Okay? Now, is Ingrid gone? You remember when I did that soldering? Nope. Hello, Nancy. How oh. goes it? Thanks for your help. You bet. Um, I have some new suspicions. I was doing some, um, you know... When I'm not playing the game, I'm also thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Now, I think Elliot, the thing that has not been answered for me yet is why he has an entire pile of, was that the pile of wood? He had some wood and then he wouldn't talk about it. And I'm suspicious that he's carving carousel horses, but I don't really know why he would be doing that. I can use this to measure. And I just don't know what we're measuring either. Well, I mean, we're definitely going to solve this mystery today once hey, I figure Nance, out what's going on. Once I'll let you get back to work. I figure out what's going must. on. So Elliot's suspicious, still suspicious, a little bit suspicious of Ingrid too, but unsure. Yeah, carousel horses are hey, made Nancy, of wood. What's up? They're a work of art. I'll see you around. Knock them dead. A work of art. Um. What was I? What's in the box? Oh, no, no, no. So what was I in the, um, what, what was I doing? <laughs> why do I have a, oh, I remember why I have the pencil. What was I doing at the end of the last episode? The first eight notes of your favorite band. Oh, that's right. Plus one. I got the mouth organ. A smidgen of talent equals one happy Oh, that's right. I need to play the first eight notes. And do we know where those are? It's locked. I remember going in here. And this is where the radiator is. Okay. And someone told me, this is not something that I had realized. What if the car comes out of there and just runs over me and I just die? Are they selling the hand in in the game with Manette? They're selling the arm of this thing or something? Is that what y'all told me? I think that's what y'all told me. This kind of looks like that kind of looks like something that um Lizzie McGuire would wear in the hit Lizzie McGuire movie, the Lizzie McGuire movie. Where she's trying all of the stuff on as Isabella Parigi. That symbol looks familiar. So we already figured this out, right? We pushed that and that opened the keyhole. The hit movie that Liz McGuire's in, the Liz McGuire movie starring Liz McGuire. Have y'all seen that one? See, it kind of looks like the um the igloo thing that she wears. We had, oh yeah, remember, well I didn't die. I set the hotel on fire, but I wasn't in it at the time. So it honestly, it kind of wasn't my problem. It wasn't my problem. Also, someone told me in the comment section, literally um, the name of the ride I went on in on Wildwood Pier in New Jersey. And I was like, holy cow. They knew. Ah! Ah! It was an ant. 
It was an ant. It was on my arm. I'm going to put a piece of tape on it and lift it from my skin. <laughs> Everything is fine. I apologize that that was jarring. I apologize that that was jarring. God. Oh, God. Get the, it's been, someone told me it's been a wild summer for ants, and I don't know how they're getting up here to the third and or fourth floor, but I have just about had it. I see about two a day now, and I'm not about it. It's not, it's not the move. Wait, what was this? The music plays in the ballroom every night a hundred feet. How do we get Ingrid out? I need... What's this? Why do I have a gun? Oh, that's the soldering iron. Um, is that the reset button? Remember when that safe had a reset button and I kept hitting it? In that other game. What if you look up in the rafters and there's just a naked person just about to drop a turd on you? Alright, I'm basically just remembering where everything is. 2022 is really the year of realizing things. All right, I have an idea. Oh, can I not talk to him? I don't have permission. I don't have permission to talk to him. All right, chat. Dear chat, I need a hint. Not literally four minutes in, I need a hint. <laughs> I need a hint. Hint. What are we yelling about? Oh, the, the naked man about to turd on us? What if that person is a pigeon? No, maybe they're dressed like a pigeon, but it's got to be a real person. There's a whole part of the carousel I haven't seen yet. I'm missing something at the carousel. Thank y'all so much. That's I really all. do need to get this work done. R right. Sorry. That's fine. You do you. So it turns out I haven't even explored everything. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait, where's my crab card? Did I even try to do this? You're about to experience the Captain's Cove Carousel. In case you were wondering, you have three fun credits left on your card. Enjoy the ride. Thank you. Oh, I don't have control over this. Will be I wouldn't have seconds, picked that one. So hang on tight. I would have picked one of the mermaid the ones. Ring. Wait, what did it say about brass rings? Don't I need a brass ring? I feel like at the very end of the last stream, someone came in and Here said, comes the brass Does ring. he have the brass get ring? Got it. I got it. Wait, what happens if I get the brass ring? Oh, now I just... do. I, am I just supposed to enjoy it now? Okay, I'm just enjoying it. Here it comes again. Okay. Oh, oh shit! Oh, I'm dead! Help! I'm dead! You're in the emergency room. <laughs> I fell off the castle. I was Help! trying to grab the brass ring and reached too far. I thought I already got what? it. It's kind of a long story. Uh-oh. I have to hang up now. They want to x-ray my head. I should probably come down there and have my head examined too. What was I thinking asking you to play detective? It's true. I'm a well, dumb old teenager. Now. You're off the case. Where's the actual deaths the in this game? will be starting in three seconds, Shit. so hang on tight. And don't forget to try for the brass ring. Yeehaw! Didn't I not get it the first time? I thought I already had it too. So I don't need to get it again. I just Here need to get it the one time. Ring. Okay, everyone get calm ready. down. Missed. I, how can you miss when I clicked it? Clicking it is called getting it. 
Isn't clicking it called getting it? Here it comes again. It's almost. How does she spin that much? I don't You're want to victim blame her, but I think she's I faking it. I fell off the carousel. It. I was trying to grab the brass ring and reach too far. But it, that time walk? it said I didn't get it. It's kind of a it. long story. Uh-oh, I have to hang up now. They want to x-ray my head. I should probably come down there the and ants. have my head examined too. What was I thinking, asking you to play detective? Well, I know what I'm thinking now. You're off the case. That's fair. The carousel will be starting in three seconds, so hang on tight. And don't forget to try for the brass ring. I think that she's over the Yeehaw! case and she's looking for a way out. Nobody rolls twice. Nobody rolls twice falling off a carousel. Here comes the brass ring. Get ready. Got it. I got it. If it doesn't have seatbelts, they wanted you to die on it. Here it comes again. So I'm not reaching again. I already have it, right? Why does she say here it comes again if it's in my hand? She just walked right off of there. I didn't even do that. Why did I want this? Well... Well, I'll give it to Ingrid. I'm going to propose. Hello, Nancy. Oh, How mind. goes it? Thanks for your help. Remember, niacin. I'm not done yet? You mean on the carousel? First of all, I haven't dear chatted. But second of all, dear chat, I'm not done? Am I not done with the carousel? I know what to do. I'm supposed to wear it as a nose ring. I know what to do. I still haven't seen the part of the carousel I missed? Really? I thought I clicked on everything. I can't go any further this way. All right, hold on. Okay, I'll get to digging. Y'all don't tell me. It's it's off again. Dear chat, shut up. <laughs> uh, dear chat. Shut up. In a in a nice way, I'm saying that. In a nice way, I'm saying that, though. Oh. That wasn't there. That's never been there. I would have known. I, would, I see I everything. I I'm going to have to call Tink. Whoever he is. Call Tink? Okay. Did it put that in there for me? Perfect. Yeah, yeah, this is Tank. Yes, hello. My name is Nancy Drew. I never heard of you. Yes, I know. I'm trying to help Ms. Santos figure what out what caused voice the roller coaster modulator? accident to shut down Captain's Cove. So why are you calling me? I run the carousel. I don't know from coasters. Well, to make a long story short, I need to find out the name of the band organ song that's on the third roll. What for? Don't ask me fucking questions. I burned down the hotel. You think I did that on accident? Maybe your house catches fire on accident. That's kind of where the long story part comes in. I haven't got time for long stories. Besides, how do I know you even know Miss Santos? Okay, to get your number, I had to get the band organ open, right? And Let's to get connect the band the organ dots, open, tink. I had to have an access card. And to get an access card... You'd have to know Ms. Santos. Yeah, 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 I get your point. Problem is, I got no idea what song's on the third roll. What Only is this voice modulator they put on their freaking voice? Does the band organ still play paper rolls? 
Where's the third roll, Tink? Where is the third roll? Getting real sick of the runaround. In the cabinet in the gear room. You mean the one that's locked? 18, 9, 39. That's a combination. Oh, and one more thing. Got You're going to have a problem when you go to load the roll on account of... Holy moly! I either snagged a greyhound boss or the biggest fish in the Shaplow River is right here in the end of my line! <laughs> I'm sorry, but I gotta go! Take the shot. Take the shot. Oh. She's pass. <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Oh. This is where the air comes out. This is where the air comes out. Yes, I know there's I air know. coming out of each pipe. If I could just see the air, I could figure out the sequence of notes. Not if I could the see the air. I better turn this off. Oh, I quite like it. Not if I could see the air. If only... Nancy's sitting behind this carousel. If only I could see air. Me talking to myself, myself in the shower. If only I could see air. Okay, 18. Wait a minute. That's not a combination. This thing only goes to nine. Thirty eighteen nine thirty nine. It goes to ninety nine. Oh, wait, that's twenty. I don't know how this thing works. No, what? No, I can only in go increase by tens. Oh, wait a minute. There's two buttons. Oh! Hmm. <laughs> I'm 24 and... Did you not have locks like this on your locker in school? Not for 2069. The brutal move even... Plays the harmonica by ear? Can what can, can we can, can we not can we not talk about other people playing this game better than me? <laughs> Have y'all seen that person who plays this on YouTube and is smarter than Joe? Alright. Let's get the fan. She said, get the fan, right? <laughs> Elliot had a fan. Right? Hello? Oh, shit. Hi, Nancy. KJ Paris. I got some preliminary info on that jewel thief. You know Chaz Dunning? Great. Oh, yeah, Let's maybe. Hear it. Okay. Before he died, he got to be real good buddies with his cellmate at New Jersey State Prison. And his cellmate was paroled less than two months ago. Oh, okay. Do you know the guy's name? Well, apparently he's used a lot of aliases. The guy I talked to wasn't sure which name he was released under. But I know who that is. That's the security guard. Dark hair, medium build, clean shaven, heavy Jersey accent. Like I said, I'm still in the process of making calls. I just thought I'd let you know what I had so far. Thanks, Detective. You've been a big help. You just described everyone in New Jersey. But second of all, they're talking about the security guard. So now we know the security guard's backstory. Not they were cellmate. And they were cellmates. Hey, Nance. What's going on? Oh, I'll nothing. let you get back to work. Really... If you must. I don't, I don't know what it is. I don't know what she'll talk to you about. <laughs> Is there a fan in the carousel? Okay, dear chat. 
Oh, wait. Now, let's go accuse him of being in New Jersey, first of all. I'm going to accuse him of being in New Jersey. <gasps> Just as I suspected, he's in New Jersey. Requested code. Oh, that's highlighted in yellow. That makes me think that that's something to write down. Um, oh, a calculator. Someone smart. <laughs> oh, a calculator. I need a tape. A VHS. Don't worry, I'll find one. Wait, so where did he go if he's not looking at stuff? Oh, someone smart. A calculator. I thought I could click on these at a different moment. Oh, or was it this? I might have flipped some breakers. Come on, Nancy. One oh one one nine oh. Okay, um, here we go. Here we go. I got one for you. Dear chat, how the fuck do these combinations work? That's what I want to know. Dear chat. That's the question on everyone's mind. For the combo, just use the digits he mentioned. Instead of 18, enter 1, then 8. So is this... Um, now I ha so I'm overthinking. Okay, that makes sense. Now, I do have another question. And that question is this 101190. Is that the combination to his one? Okay, click the click the triangle button after each one, okay. Yeah, the big one definitely reset. So that's the combination to his as well. That's Harlan's combo. Okay, see because and y'all know that I suspected that because I just asked y'all that, so Just as I suspected. A picture of Judy Garland. Just Lewis as I G. suspected. I wonder who that is. Best way to find out is to call him. <gasps> Two for one at Bonanza Burger? Someone's getting turned. What was their name? L Louis? Ah. State Board of Parole, Louis Scarra's office. I'm sorry, what did you say? I said, State Board of Parole, Louis Guerra's office. Is Mr. Guerra a parole officer? That's correct, but he's out of the office right now. Would you like to leave a message? Maybe you can help me. Do you know if he has a client named Harlan Bishop? Yes, he does. Is Harlan up to something he shouldn't be? I didn't say that. No, but is that Mrs. Parole? Doubtfire? You know? We're going to have to wait and ask Mr. Guerra that question. What was the name? Nancy Drew. My number is 523 Yeah, just tell this criminal that here's my real name and That's we're snooping on him. You can call me anytime. I'll let him know. Thank you. Make sure to tell Harlan, who just got out of prison, that my name is Nancy Drew and I'm snooping around in his stuff. Meg stick? Men stick? Does he have anything? Oh. Take one of those shoes and just... I know some of y'all in the chat want to do it. Some of y'all in the chat been thirsting over Harlan. Hmm, I'll just 
play it and find out. Some of y'all in the chat want to sniff Harlan's shoes, and that's fine. That's no kink shaming here, but I know for a fact. I know. <laughs> I know. I told you. It looks like Harlan's been spying on Ingrid. Zero seven two six. I better put this back where I found it. Not. I hope this tape isn't homemade. It's Harlan doing his boulder hole recipe. This is before YouTube, so he just had to record it and watch it himself. All right, I gotta go back to the carousel, and then I gotta go yell at someone, I guess. Oh, I forgot what I was doing here, but now I understand. Yeah, that zoom in was like NCIS enhance. All right, so this was at eighteen nine thirty nine. So, oops. This is just not how safes work. Let's see. Miles said the song is on the third roll. This must be it. Now, they want me to look at air. Now, now they told me to look at... That I'm supposed to be able to see the air. This looks a little like the inside of my aunt's player piano. The take-up dowel is broken. Oh, I have a pencil. Oh. I just put a pencil there. Why isn't she just putting a pencil there? Piece of sh Piece of shit. <laughs> Can't even build something that lasts. Build something, you know? Trash. Hadn't even lasted a hundred years. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to... Oh, wait. I think she's gone. Oops. Is she gone? Yeah. Call LH about results. LH. Lance Huffington, maybe? Um, I don't know. Let's give him a call. Nancy just thinks she can really just call everybody. There's no nine on the keyboard. Talk to me. Yes, hi. Um, is this Lance Huffington? You betcha. Who's this? Well, I'm Nancy Drew. I work with Ingrid Corey. I'm kind of her unofficial assistant here at the park. She tells me everything. Oh, yeah. This is, Nancy is on it today. She's just spitting the lies. She's just spitting the freaking lies. Yeah, I was wondering if she'd called you yet. You know, about the results. Yeah, she called me. So, is everything okay? Everything's great. Her plan worked. I'm glad she shared it with me. Life's good. <laughs> At least it will be when the trial's over and the settlement's in the Is bank. she suing Whoa, the park? Speaking of which, I gotta go. I'm due in court. What'd you say your name was? Uh, Nancy. Well, Nancy, next time you call me, you could very well be talking to a multimillionaire. Oh! Oh, multimillionaire? I will be calling him back. Then I will be calling him back. Okay, Rich. All right, let's do some what we in the industry call sausage. Sausage sleuthing. <gasps> oh. 
Oh my god, it's a watch. Wow, that's <laughs> one expensive watch. Oh my god, $21,198.94? Is there a phone number? Let me guess. 6095, it's probably already in my phone book, but just in case it's not. Give them a call. Paid in cash? I think she's suing the Parkers, or she sued her last employer. I don't know. Oh. Okay, I can't click anything else over here. Every time I try to, it just clicks back to that. Let's see what's on this side. I don't... Oh. Oh, yeah, that's the car. Oh. wonder if she's... All right, let me get out my phone again. Who can I tell on? Nancy's looking to snitch. Oh, I'll call him myself. <laughs> Who can I tell on? <laughs> So that I can get attention. Please check the number and dial again. This is a recording. Who can I call to get attention? Um, Baby Olives, by the way. Thank you for the year. Thank you, thank you. Keep those skus, skus, skus going. Uh, Dance to Toffee Day. Thank you so much, too. Good to see you. Make sure there's nothing over here. There's so much to snoop, and Nancy doesn't want to snoop any of it. If I were gonna, if I were a dowel. Oh. Hello? Hi, it's Paula. Just thought I'd check in, see how you're doing. Actually, I'm kind of glad you called. Why? What's going on? I'm afraid I've discovered something kind of disturbing about Harlan. What, that he's an ex-con? I know. Ex-cons still deserve to get jobs. Like, what the fuck is she doing? Was she fucking... Nancy's telling on him? How long have you known? It was the first thing out of his mouth when he applied for the job. He said being an outstanding security guard would... Good, Nancy! For all ...that he's gone straight. I also found out that he used a security camera to get the code to Ingrid's work area. And he fits a description of the jewel thief cellmate that Detective Paris gave me. Oh, now that's disturbing. But I'm still going to give Harlan the benefit of the doubt until I have good reason not to. I appreciate your bringing this to my attention, though. All right. Goodbye, Paula. She is just loving that she got to spill that tea. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. <laughs> I'm just grabbing the ruler. Rach! Connected those dots. I'm telling hey, you. Hey, Nance. Thank What's you so on? much. Oh, I, I need, need the dowel. I need to make a dowel to replace this broken one from the band organ. Would it be all right if I used your equipment? I won't make a mess. I promise. Sure. Got a lathe, wooden rods, safety goggles? Knock yourself out. I gotta go run an errand, though, so try not to cut off any appendages until I get back. Y'all don't know this about me? <laughs> but I... It's all fun and games until somebody loses an eye. Oh, should I not wear those and then see what happens? Oh. Um, I took woodworking. That's not wood. In fact, what I'm thinking... Wait, where's wood? To carve a new dowel, I'm going to need a piece of wood. Just as I suspected. Better leave these goggles here. Is this wood? Oh, that's a fan. Oh, maybe it'll let me see air. I can see it! No. No! So, it must be behind me where the ruler is. Wait, what was that package? Wait, what was that? Wigs. <laughs> Those look like horse tails. I think they've started to make it obvious that he's making reproduction horses. Wigs. 
She just opened his mail? That's a federal crime. I can use this to measure. Okay. Where do I... He said he had a wood... He said he had some wood for me. All right. If I were wood... I see there's wood right here. But I don't think that... I think that wood is too big. There's wood here. Oh, yeah. Oops. I don't need another rod. I've already got one. All right. Well, then let's just calm down, shall we? Let's measure it to see... I should measure that. Maybe. 14 inches. Ugh, amateurs. 14 inches. Oh, is that 14 or 14 and a half? That's 14. All right, we'll just... Let's not put the goggles on this time. Oh, it makes me. Okay. This is the thing that makes Nancy be safe. Oh, there we go. But that's already 14 inches. Oh, we just have to whittle it down now, huh? Oh, how thin does it have to be? Oh. Ah. Uh. Oh, this is dumb. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Do I have to do this to every fucking inch of it? I think that's too thin. I think I made it too thin. All right. That doesn't look right. Scrap it, Nancy. Scrap it. Um, Sugar Bean, thank you for the two months. Good to see you. Kick at Moss. Not the screaming. Thank you for the bits. Sunburnt Luck Toast, thank you for the gift sub. Uh, Rage, thank you again for the bits. Oh, <laughs> that impact. Sonoko96, thank you for the 22 months. I hope you're having a good lunch break. So, hold on. I should have looked at this one. What does this one look like? Did I leave it at the fucking table? Leave these goggles here. Suit yourself, Nancy. So it's teeny in the now. Why would you make it like that? Oh, okay. I should draw a diagram of it. I know what I'm doing. Y'all, shut up, dear. Ch <laughs> I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm like this. Okay, I'm gonna draw the stick. So the first. So. 2.5 inches of full thickness. And then we have from two and a half to 11 and a half of skin tea. Then we have from 11 and a half to 12 of full. This is so dumb. Why does it gotta be like this? Then we have... Do I have to do that teeny little... Look at, like, that thing right there? Oh, how did this... How did I start wearing this t-shirt? Let's make this dowel, which is what I've been doing this whole time. Um... <laughs> here, we, here we go, here we go, here we go. Now, if I remember, this is how they make the wands in Harry Potter. Oh, y'all, I don't even think I was doing the right thing last time. Not that this is a new time. This is still last time as well. <laughs> You're doing great. Magical shirt change. Exclamation point merch in the chat. Okay, if you're into that. Oh, and I remember y'all hated this sound. Maybe this sound gave me the migraine last time. Wait, do y'all remember what the dowel looked like? You Only moments ago when we looked at it. If you remember, I'm trying to get my notebook, weasel out my notebook. There it is. Okay. Did I write this down anywhere? How about, um, dear chat, 
um, dear chat, what's the dowel? Dear chat, am I on the... Oh, wait. The ends are supposed to be big. Hold on, I'm going to go look at it. That doesn't look right. Yeah, I know. Better leave these goggles here. I know. Okay. Dear chat. Dear chat, where's my notebook? <laughs> Dear chat. So it needs to be big, small, small, small. And then does this notch have to be there? Because I'm not sure I can do a notch like that. Don't put the glasses on next time. All right, we'll do that real quick. Let's just get this death scene over with or whatever. I'm sure I'll just end up in the ER. It's very upsetting. Oh, I need a dowel. All right, no safety goggles. Ramp it up on high. Oh! You're in the hospital with a piece of wood in your eye? Several pieces, actually, but the doctors got most of them out. I used Elliot's lathe without wearing eye protection. <laughs> Never do that again. Why were you using Elliot's lathe? Don't make it as I was deep. making a new dowel for the band organ. I'm beginning to think being cursed is nothing compared to having you around. You're off the case. Is this because I burned down the hotel? Or is it because I cr got crushed by the merry-go-round? Or is it because I rolled, I tucked and rolled off of the merry-go-round? There's a lot of reasons it, it could be, and it's just, uh, I need to know which Oops, one. I don't need another rod. I've already got one. I thought I clicked that. Okay. So not as deep. So maybe the middle one. Oh, and I'm not supposed to do that part. I oh, man, I sure that have wasted. Does it look right? I sure have wasted a lot of wood. <laughs> well, you know, I just don't know if we have no trees for this. This sounds like the clown's music in Dead by Daylight or something. Now, is this the right depth? Or do you? Or does it need to be deeper than that? Because I think I. Th I don't know. Maybe that's not as much as it needs to be. What the fuck happened there? How do I fix that? Oh, I understand. Chat, don't worry about it. I understand. Don't even worry about it. Dear chat, shut up. <laughs> no need for the middle. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. We're sleuthing now. Don't y'all worry about it. I also realize that this changes the thickness of it as well. Oh. Too much. Okay, keep it going. Keep it going. Now, now, one more of these, right? Oh, gotta knock it over or not. I do, dear chat, one more that deep? Do I do one more that deep? Dear chat, dearest chat, I hope this letter finds you well. How are you today, chat? Dearest chat, one more of this. Okay, one more, thank you. And then am I supposed to do one more? Am I supposed to do one more at medium length? Dear chat. Now what? Do I, I do one more medium length? Because it looked like there was a, a teeny notch here. One more shallow. Now by shallow, do you mean one click, two click, or three click? So, is that team That looks perfect. Thank you, chat. Better leave these goggles here. I just wish I could take the goggles with me. Y'all, I'm pretty sure that 
Elliot is making horses. We found his box of wigs. He's either turning it out at the local drag bar, in which case, work queen. But I also have a hunch that those weren't wigs, that those were horse tails. Can you believe? Not sure it's a compliment if your wig looks like a horse tail. <laughs> I don't know. Some horses have really nice hair. Horses have really nice hair. All right. So let's put the dowel here. Put that on the dowel. Oh, and don't I need to see air? Dear air. I need to switch from CD to roll. This is where the air comes out. This is where the air comes out. All I need are some strips of tissue paper. But I think I can do this. I have... I don't know if y'all know this about me. <laughs> we need a compilation of... We need a compilation of... I don't think y'all know this about me. <laughs> but I was runner-up to play the youngest uh, boy in A Sound of Music. The Sound of Me, but A, The Sound of Music musical. And I also was the lead role in several musicals as a child. <laughs> I was closeted. It's true. Oh, wow, Ashley. Thank you, Shelby. Exclamation point merch in the chat. Yes, that is true. Yeah, I don't tell y'all everything. Yeah, was it is Kurt the youngest one? So I refused. So I was I was really young. And at right now, I'm great at harmonizing. I'm really good at harmonizing. However, back then, when I was like, I don't even know how old I was, I just refused to do the harmony parts. So the other kid got it. I said, I sing lead and lead only. I went in there and I said, I will sing lead. I will see, sing lead only. <laughs> God. <laughs> I was like eight. Fuck. Not the Kroger commercial. Okay, Brad. Okay, Rich. <laughs> My family, we were getting groceries out of, out of a garbage bin. Okay, Rich. I was throwing my charts over the fifth. <laughs> okay, let's play the game. Oh, I need some tape. We're going to do this the old-fashioned way. Oh. And get some tape. Nancy keeps trying to get on the horses. Um, I don't know. I feel like Ingrid had tape. Oh, wait. I feel like I saw tape somewhere. Or post-it notes. You think I could take her post-it notes? <laughs> I was putting stump water on my warts. Okay. And I was. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? I understand that you know the man who got hurt in that roller coaster accident, Lance Huffington? I, I've talked to him. I don't really know him. What did you talk to him about? Look, what are you getting at? I was just wondering if you were a murderer. <laughs> I don't remember what we're accusing people of. 
You and he could be partners. He gets on the roller coaster, you shut off the power. The coaster is stopped suddenly. He cries whiplash and sues the park. You share the settlement. Interesting theory. Unfortunately, it's totally wrong. I called him to tell him to rub his neck three times a day with witch hazel and lavender. <laughs> if his neck is really injured, that will cure it. Why are you so eager to accuse me of something? No witch hazel. Oh, because you're rich. Because you seem to have a lot of money, far more than the park pays you. I can't help but wonder where it's coming from. All right. I have been making money on the side, but it's not what you think. I've been helping someone design a roller coaster. I even let him borrow the blueprints for our coaster. You can't just ask people so where they get their money. Them, not steal them. I kept it secret because it could be construed as conflict of interest. This guy knows I'm taking a risk, so he pays me very well. Now, your turn. It's obvious that you've been nosing around in here. How did you get in? You can't just ask people about being in the Panama Papers, Nancy. <laughs> ah! Oh my fucking god. I love this. Um, someone made a tape of you entering your security code. Oh, uh, we won't go that far. Oh, we have to accuse them either way. Um, Someone just, made a tape fine. of you entering your security code into the keypad outside, which I just happened to see. Harlan. I knew it bugged him that this place was off limits, but spying on me? That guy's got a real problem. As for you, I'd appreciate it if you would kindly remove your nice and deficient little <laughs> self from my office. I have work to do. <gasps> that hurt! My nice and deficient little ass? That's not what she said, but... That's what I heard. My little, my grubby little, nice and deficient ass. Not this Rev Dot. Rev Dot, thank you for the 19 months. Witch hazel and lavender on my neck. You know what? I'll get right on it. <laughs> thank you. Susie Sims a lot. We got a first time sub. Thank you so much. Welcome. The game over. In five, yes, we got to do the game over, Kit Kat Moss. Thank you so much for the bits. I appreciate that. Any luck? Oh. I think we're all set. I know the tune, and I've got a harmonica. Don't worry. Play it for miles and see what happens. My oral sensors are ready. Suck oh, oral. <laughs> Not my oral sensors are ready. I just start playing Amelie. I gotta go. Close, but no cigar. Maybe I should go listen to the tune again and come back later. We will be waiting. All right, I gotta go get some strips of paper. If I need some strips of paper, why not just cut some little pieces off of Joy's hair? <laughs> she looks like she hasn't conditioned it. In. <laughs> hey, Nancy, what's up? I'll see you around. Sounds good. Did we already accuse him of being in prison? Oh, does Elliot have tape? Oh, maybe Elliot has. Oh, well, well there's the tape on the fan. Can I just take the tape off the fans? Nancy said, I see what I need right in front of me, but I refuse to check it. Fuck. Oh, let's see what he's doing. I never snooped, did I? He draws seahorses for a living. That's cool. Good for him. Do what you like. Do what you love. You know? Oh, that's tape. The fuck is this not tape? Just tear up some of this stuff. I don't know. Sometimes I like to put tape on stuff. That is infuriating. Because I knew I had seen tape somewhere. And there it is. And I can't even use it. Okay, dear chat. Where could I find... Whoa, whoa, wait. Don't tell me yet. Don't tell me yet. I have a, one more idea. Exactly one more idea. That's to check my email. 
Emma K95. Thank you for the four months. Oh my gosh, I hope you're having a good break. I hope you're having a good day in general. Thank you so much. Good to have you here. Brit Steps, thank you for the bids. Once again, I appreciate that so much. Oh yeah, there's that radiator key. Y'all, I've done so much. Like, oh my god. Oh yeah, the note I found in Joy's office. What was that about? Oh, was that this? I don't know. Um, something, something, find the key. I wish you could scroll down more because it just bumped me all the way back up to the top. Wow, no new emails. It's almost like I haven't done much. Okay. Oh, toilet paper? Did y'all say toilet paper? Hello? This is Luis Guerra with the State Board of Parole. I understand you have some questions concerning Harlan Bishop. Right. Hi. Uh, yes, for starters, could you tell me what prison he was in? He served 30 months in Bayside State Prison. I guess that's public record, forgery. right? He was paroled five weeks ago. Was he ever at New Jersey State Prison? No, ma'am. Did he ever have a cellmate named Chaz Dunning? No, ma'am. As far as I know, Harlan is a security guard at Captain's Cove Amusement Park. Now, do all these questions mean you know something about him that I don't? Actually, maybe, Actually, maybe I, I do. <laughs> oh, what? You failed to mention that he's one of the nicest guys you'd ever want to meet. Very true. Well, I hope I've been of some assistance. Oh, you have. You've been a big help. Thank you. So it's not Harlan. Bye. He wasn't even in prison with the guy. So Harlan is crossed off of my list. That means it's either Ingrid or Elliot. Joy, let's just say... I'm not sure she has... I'm not sure she has the... Hmm... The ideas in her brain to do that. <laughs> okay, dear chat, where do I get some fucking paper? Because I feel like I've looked everywhere where there would be paper. And I feel like I looked at the place where there would be tape. I'm missing something at Elliot's studio? Okay. Oh, is it the trash can? Oh, no. Should I rip up his drawing? That's oh. a Poppy Dada. She's just fucking making up words, isn't she? <laughs> She's just fucking making up words, huh? We just making up words now? Oh, it's a reference to Game 7? Oh, okay. She's just making up shit these days, huh? Can I tear up a book? I should tear up a book. That's exactly what I should do. Alright, don't tell me what I'm missing. I'm missing something, and I need to figure out what that something is. I'll figure it out, don't y'all worry. Don't y'all worry. Because old Josephine is on the case. Can y'all tell me what this is that I'm holding? What is this stick? I can see the wind. Oh, that's my paper yo-yo. Okay. I remember my paper yo-yo. Now, something that I might be missing. That's not like me. We saw the wigs. I wish I could... I could probably glue a wig to that stuff. Now, don't tell me. Oh, I didn't know I could zoom in over here. Tissue strips. Just what I need. Fucking Nancy really couldn't just have torn up something else. She really couldn't have. 
That is some nonsense. Clear tape. Yes. That is some nonsense. Okay. This is the part where we do it. Huh. Okay. Tape. This is where the air comes out. I need to put the tissue strips on first. A E ah! Ah! I better turn Stop. this off. Stop. A E D D E A E D E F D A E D E F D Oh D E F E Hold on No can it start over We should I'll sing really low. D C B A E One more time. <laughs> Rachel Berry. Okay, I got it. I better turn this off. I don't, nobody cares if you turn off. Nobody's going to this park. Oh. Guess I'll just leave the tape on there. Oh. Excuse me. <laughs> if I ever die and I have a robot, just know that mine is the first notes of Amelie. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Am I in trouble for calling his parole officer? <laughs> I just got off the phone with Miss Santos. Where do you get off telling her I'm some kind of jewel thieving peeping Tom? She called you? Of course she called. She hired me because she thought I deserved a second chance. She wanted to make sure I hadn't we betrayed her trust, which I hadn't, by the way. I know that now, and I'm really sorry. I figured if I did a good job here, it would prove to everybody once and for all that I was totally trustworthy. Hey, Nancy's a turd. I was more than just an ex-con. A lot more. Okay, so maybe I'm trying a little too hard. Maybe people's entry codes should be off limits. It's just that this job means everything to me. I don't want to screw it up. I guess I was a little overzealous, too. I I'm really sorry. I'll see you around. She just gets to say sorry and leave. <laughs> Will Nancy Drew please report to the security office? Are you fucking kidding me? I already... What do I you want? I stepped out for a second. Oh. And when I came back, somebody left this envelope on my desk. Looks like it's for you. <laughs> Got your name on He's it. He's anyway. like, I just wrote this suspicious note while you There's were gone. There's nothing inside but a key. Oh. Maybe it opens that door in the haunted house. Here, let me toss that envelope for you. I want to apologize for jumping all over you like that before. No. The more I thought you about don't need it, to apologize. The more I realized that I would have done just what you did. No hard feelings. No hard feelings. He did not need to apologize to us. We needed to apologize to him. Why did she think that was to the haunted house? My first thought would that would be... Oh, yeah, that's where the radiator is, huh? Anyway. Oh, I guess we have to talk to Joy about Any you. Any luck? I think we're all Trust set. Trust me. I know me. the tune, and I've got a harmonica. Play it for Miles and see what happens. My oral sensors are ready. Suck it to me. Hmm. Thank you. 
Did I do that wrong? Uh oh. Hooray! Oh, okay, I remember good. that song. <laughs> I did my ride Brittany. the carousel over and over and over. Always the same horse. Always the same black horse. You love the carousel, and you loved one horse in particular. It was not the lead horse, and it was not spectacular, but you loved it, Joy. What was its name? I can't remember. Do you know the name? Of course I do. I am Miles the Magnificent Memory Machine. I can throw, However, drop a brick on my head. I am not programmed to continue unless and until you remember the name of that horse. You loved it so much that your mother bought it for you. She was the one who bought the horse off the carousel? That's interesting. The park must have a record of that transaction. I haven't seen it, but you're right. It must be around here somewhere. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I'll be right here. I know, Joy. I know you don't have a life. We get it. It's locked. Telling me where I can and can't go. Now that's bullshit. Excuse me. Now that's bullshit. Now let me get out my zapper. Let me get out my key. It's locked. I clicked it. Nice. Maybe these stairs go down to Kessler's workshop. What was that? Uh oh, am I gonna die? <laughs> I'm not gonna move. <laughs> you were unconscious for how long? I'm not sure. Whatever fell on my head also fell on my arm and broke my watch. I can't afford any more accidents, Nancy. And since you seem to be rather accidental, they don't know how long well, she was down there. Her off the case. I say, I'm getting a lot of money from all this settlement. All right, I know I have to click back. That? I just wanted to die. Damn. Can I not go any further? Am I supposed to chase? Who did that? You're under arrest. Citizens arrest. <laughs> Citizens arrest. Wait, where am I going? It's locked. Am I supposed to save? Yeah, all I got was, that's all I got was pliers. Maybe I can give this thing surgery now. Give it the old pliers. I guess that was it. The music just got really intense for a minute. I thought I needed to do something else. Oh, okay. Yeah, the music was way too, like, hyped up. I thought for sure I was going to need to do something. Oh. Hold on. I want to go back and check in there again. Because I just heard the sounds from below again. This is just unnecessary. Really, Nancy said, I don't want to explore this thing that almost got dropped on me? She really said, just let it go. She said, live and let live. Okay, sis, pop off. All right, I'm going to go yell at someone. Oh, thank you, Panda Bear. I appreciate that. She said, let go and let God. She said, 
She said, God will take care of that in the afterlife. She said, I, it is not I who will pass judgment. <laughs> Book hag, we got a first time sub. Thank you so much. Welcome. Uh, Mars Luna, thank you for the bids. I appreciate that so much. I bet these were her pliers. Uh, Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits too. The whole alphabet. Mars Luna. <laughs> Peeping Tom, thank you again for the bits. And Rai Rai Gal, not the murder pliers. Hello, Nancy. How goes it? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Here's your pliers. I found them in the haunted house behind that hidden door, which led to a booby trap. I told you mine were missing. Maybe somebody found them and left them by that door on purpose. I don't know. But they prove nothing. I do know that. Thanks for your help. Remember. Don't leave town. Madison. Don't leave town, Ingrid. Where are you, Elliot? I just came in here to spiral. Um, I guess. Oh, wait. I need to find the name of that horse. Any luck with the name? I'm still working on it. Need something? No. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I really appreciate your help. I have an idea. Oh, is it in that book that I... S Hold on. I remember there were some records. Oh, did these have names? No. And those aren't black horses. I have an idea. Don't worry about me. Goopa and Jetpack. Who do we think done it? Ingrid or Elliot? I think they're trying to make Ingrid a little too obvious. And that's why I'm starting to think it's Elliot. Because he has all that. No one's mentioned the wigs and the wood. That he has stuffed in his office. So that's why I'm thinking he's at least making replicas or something. Oh, and that might also explain why he's always behind on his work. Thank you for the bits. And Kit Kat Moss just spiraling in the art studio. That's just what happened when I got my art minor. Just spiraled. All about carousels. Oh, well, I'm really looking for like a receipt, aren't I? Not fantastic. So that's a horse. Foxfire. Do you think that's it? Oh yeah, my favorite browser, Foxfire. Yeah, I think I know the horse's name. Can I talk? Any luck with the name? I'm still working on it. Need oh. something? I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I really appreciate your help. Eh. All right, I need the receipts. Hey, Nancy, what's up? I'll see you around. Go get them. I don't know what happened to the music. It's too weird now. So Ingrid hates me, Harlan hates me, Joy hates everyone, Elliot likes me too much. I feel like I'm done there. Let's go back to the captain's quarters real quick. Oh, I should maybe make a phone call. Wait, what's this binder? Oh. Wait, does that thing have... Okay. Yeah, that... They're done. Oh, this thing! Yeah, we don't know. Oh! To sell the horse named... I'm supposed to top it... Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Maybe its name was Rebecca? Charlotte? 
Patricia. Joy. Rachel. Friday. What would I name a horse? Um. <laughs> Barbie. Maybe Barbie. Sunshine. Oh. Oh. This is the receipt. <laughs> Oh, it's midnight. Oh, it's not midnight. This is the receipt. <laughs> is this the receipt I was looking for? <laughs> oh. So this is the code that I have to decipher. So this is, is this not shorthand? I need a book about shorthand. Oh, well, I'll just look that up online. How to read shorthand. <gasps> Not moon. How to translate shorthand. This is Pittman short. You can read this? Oh, well, hold on. Translate Pittman's shorthand. Oh, I have an email about it? Oh, that's, yeah. Oh, my God, there's more. Don't worry, I have an email about it. I definitely check my email a lot. Oh, I already did that. That was the secret message. Do I have one? I'm missing an email here. Well, it's just shorthand, right? This is not a dear this is not a dear chat moment yet. No. Can I hit the start menu? No. Oh, no to that. Uh Mia Asma. Oh my gosh, enjoy your pixel hoodie. <laughs> IRL and style. We love to see it. Thank you so much. Do I have junk mail? I don't have a spam folder. Who's Pittman? Hold on, don't worry, I got it. Pittman, oh, Pitman, shorthand. Oh, shorthand. Steno. <gasps> There's a thing that translates it for you. But I can't... I can only enter text to translate it into Pittman's. I can't tra... I've got an idea. Has agreed to sell the horse named Google Lens. Oh my god. Why aren't we using technology? Just because Nancy doesn't have a fucking smartphone. I wonder if Google Lens translates shorthand. Now that's a sausage sleuth of an idea. Google Lens. It doesn't.
It doesn't do shorthand. <laughs> I think they are intended to do it with Google Lens. I don't know. The horses will be removed for the ride on August. Da, 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 da. All right, here is. All right, dear chat, is there a source I need to look for that tells me how to read shorthand? Or is, am I supposed to figure this out my, in my brain? By looking at the rest of it. Because I don't think that's how shorthand works. Not fucking Bess and George. Fucking Tweedledee and Tweedledum. They're not even together. Hello? Hey Bess, it's Nancy. Oh, hey, Nancy. <laughs> Whoa, you were obviously hoping I was someone else. Well, kinda. Is George there too? Yeah, I'm here. Which is more than I can say for my cousin. Oh, Nancy, I was hoping you were this guy named Matt. He works at the movie theater in the mall, and he is so cute. Sorry about y'all's dumb night, lives. I have more important things number. happening. She's become downright dangerous, Nance. If that phone rings and you happen to be standing between it and Bess... You're toast. Do you have time to talk? I mean, I don't want to mess up this Matt thing. Of course we have time to talk. I'm dying to hear what's going on. Besides, if Matt tries to call me and gets a busy signal, <gasps> that's a good thing. He'll think I'm popular. Fill us in, Nance, quick, before Bess's logic starts getting really twisted and I get nauseous. I need you guys to do something for me. I found some stenography notes that I'd really like to translate, only I don't know shorthand. Say no more. We'll do some research and get right back to you. We will? I barely know how to spell stenography, let alone research it. Can we'll call just... you when we're through. We can do this, Bess. What is with all this we stuff? Catch you guys later. We'll be right here. Toodles. Okay, do I just have to go somewhere so they'll call me back? If they don't call me back, I'm going to burn down this hotel. <laughs> Am I just supposed to wait for them to fucking call me? You're joshing me. Surely Joy knows how to do shorthand. She seems like she would know some mundane things. Finally. Hello? Hi, Nance. We found some stuff on stenography. Oh, so now it's we, huh? Okay, George found most of it. Surprise, surprise. But I helped. Thank you so much. You guys are the best. So go back to the hotel and check your laptop. We emailed a little tutorial to you. But you gotta promise to let us know what the note you translate says. I promise. Thanks again, you guys. I'm never calling them back. And they know I don't check my email. They should know I don't check my email. <gasps> Learning shorthand the quick way. They just sent me to a website? You're fucking kidding me. This is Duolingo. Oh, it's like phonetic writing. Okay, well, I hate that. Holy shit. This is like learning a whole new language. Holy shit. Okay. So I'm going to, um, bzz, its name is Moon. It's not. Money. Oh, I know I don't have to do the whole thing. I see that the rest of it's been written out. But I need to... So let's... 
that looks like an N and then a swirl. So I think if I just translate this part, I'll be fine. What if this is my new hobby, stenography, a dead language? Mooney. <laughs> Don't tell me I am not ready for that. So I know what S looks like. Knee. Nay. Hold on. I don't think that's that. Aha. Uh -huh. That looks like the end of it. To me, it does. So I'm going to say it ends with ray. Moon ray? Sun ray. Hold on. All right. It's neither one of those things. Okay. Continue. Aha. F moon ray. <laughs> Oh, that goes up first. So it goes up, down, and then kind of like an N. And then that little squivel. All right. I don't want anyone to tell me, by the way. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh! Very interesting indeed, if I don't, if I do say so myself. Gilroy. Gilray. Oh, no. It's not that. Instead, it's G. K. Kool Aid. Glow? Glow? No, I, I don't know that. <gasps> Glow. Glow. So that was lesson one through four. Oh, wait. That's all the lessons. So I should have known it. <laughs> So I should have known it by then. All right. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's just ridiculous. I can I feel it. I feel like I can do it. So I know I can. So let me look again. I think it starts with a G. I think it's Gloon Ray. It's not Gloon Ray. Like Balloon Ray? Oh my gosh, Minnow02 with the 12 months. I appreciate that so much. Thank you, thank you. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits as well. And Ryan, thank you for the bits. Not George Glooney. <laughs> thank you so much. Not this. Blu-ray. <laughs> no, not this. What if it's Cool Ray? 
Cool Ranch Doritos. Why did anyone ever type like this? Don't type like this. That's stupid. Oh, I guess it's for before computers. Now, if I were, it's a, it's a dip. Go. Go. Glow. Glow. Glow ray. But there's the the in thing, which I don't think is an in. are similar to the O stroke, but the K is twice as large as the O, and the G is twice as large as the K. Maybe that is a K. I like glow ray. Think phonetically. Glow. Glory? The name of the carousel horse is Glory. Nobody can take me. <laughs> Nobody can take me. I'm on the edge of glory. That's the only words to that song that I know. Any luck? I know the name of that carousel horse your mother bought you. Glory. Glory. That's right. Glory. My mother gave him to me for my birthday. Can you just fucking remember my shit, you birthday. dumb, dumb. She died in a car accident oh, that sorry. very night. Oh, Jesus Christ. Your mother was the Move one who bought anyway. that horse. <laughs> I wonder what happened to it. I hated the park after my mother died. I hated the carousel. And I hated that horse. I blamed it for what happened to my mother. I had my father destroy it. But your father did not destroy it. Instead, he stored it. He hoped that someday, with the help of... Miles, the magnificent memory machine! You would come to terms with your past. And because that is what you are doing, here is the third and final riddle. Ask Tink for the anyway. book you and I used to read about Kessler and Amelia so kind. Give her nickname a spin on spook number 10. Hmm. Then the brass prize arrange on its forearm so strange. And something long lost and cherished you'll find. <laughs> Joy's like... <laughs> Me and Joy are both looking at each other like the... <laughs> the fuck? We're in the home stretch. What do you say we do the rest of this together? No. Nancy, I did something terrible. I turned the power off to the roller coaster and caused the accident that shut down <sighs> the park. I blamed Miss Santos for my father's death, just like I blamed that horse for what happened to my mother. I feel horrible. Keep going without me, Nancy. You look horrible, too. I have to go too. see Ms. Santos and apologize. Oh. Not this. Well, we still don't know about the jewels or whatever. Oh, so I need to get, I need to call, um, Tink. Oh, I have to, I have to, I have to input a number first. That's right, that's right, that's right. This is Tink. Hi, it's Nancy Drew. Did you land that fish? I don't want to talk about it. That answer your question? According to the late Daryl Trent, you have a book about Rolf Kessler and his wife. Not anymore, I don't. You don't have it? Daryl Trent was kind of an oddball, you know what I mean? So when he gave me the book, I said I'd hang on to it just to humor him. As soon as he died, I pitched it. Did you ever read the book yourself? Nah, not really. Not Tink's a book burner. 
Do you by any chance remember Amelia's nickname? Who's Amelia? Oh, never mind. Oh, you dumb I... dumb. I'm curious. Who do you think stole that horse off the carousel? Kids. Stare at each other, doing stupid kid stuff. Or maybe somebody just liked the way old Nightshade looked and wanted him for himself. I don't know. Nightshade. Nightshade. That was its name. Nightshade. Kessler gave all of his horses names. Just Painted as I suspected. Rivals. Sounds like I've got a horse to cut up. Have fun fishing. <laughs> Always do. I am Miles, the magnificent memory machine. Joy has stepped out of the office. Thanks, Miles. The Nancy Drew entity is welcome. Oh, what am I supposed to do? Let's go through her stuff again. Hmm, looks like Joy's a pencil chewer. Does she have any Pez? I feel like someone like Joy would really like Pez. I feel like she's that kind of boring person. I was just looking for candy. Dunkle Vice, thank you so much for the four months. I appreciate that. Uh, Whimsy Daydreamer, yeah. It got, Joy's story got a little, it really turned. It really turned. Thank you so much for the bits. I have an idea, don't y'all worry. Why can't I look at, oh. Moon Glow. Moon Joe. I wish I could look at that one. God, that zebra one is in pain. Um, I have an idea. Let's just go accuse Elliot of doing it. <laughs> I have an idea. Let's just go tell everyone Elliot did it. Exactly. Half Moon Glow. Moon Joe, yes. Thank you for the bits, Kit Kat Moss. Wait, where did, where did she go to do? Did she just go to tell the police that she murdered someone? Arrange the brass ring on Spook 10's forearm so strong. Oh. Check out Spook number 10. Okay, so, hold on. Is that the dog? Who's Hannah? Who is Hannah? Yeah, the Joy storyline is weird and I hate it. Um, okay. I have an idea. I'm supposed to put the brass ring somewhere, am I not? But I feel like it's supposed to go on a horse. I need to get the, the horse pierced at Claire's and give it a nose ring? Yeah, that sounds right. Where's that other horse I could look at? Why can I only look at Moonglow now? God, these controls just... I'm so mad. Here we go. Okay, fine. I'll stop trying to put this brass ring on every fucking horse. I have an idea. 
Hannah is Nancy's second mom? I'm just confused about Nancy's entire history, if I'm being honest. Thank you so much for the bits, the money. Um, I think I need to talk to someone. I think I need to make another phone call. A professional? Oh. Let's see what Paula's up to. Let's see if she fired Joy. This is Paula Santos. I'm afraid I can't take your call right now, but if you leave your name and number, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Hi, Paula. It's Nancy. Listen, it turns out that Harlan was in a totally different prison than the jewel thief. I was wrong about him. <sighs> I'm sorry if I upset you. I'll be in touch. This is just apologizing to People Simulator because Nancy just fucks up everything. Who was L.H.? I don't feel like that was a lawyer or something. Oh, that was who Ingrid was talking to? Hello? Hi, Bess. It's only me. Oh, hi, Nance. Listen to you. You're probably making Nancy feel terrible. Maybe I should answer the phone from now on. You wouldn't dare. It's okay, guys. I understand. I'm sorry, Nancy. As you may have guessed, Matt hasn't called yet, and he is just so, so cute. cute. Anyway, what's up? Anyway. <laughs> anyway. None of these are... Oh, Got anything about this for me one? in the way of hints? I was afraid you were going to ask that. We're temporarily out. The fuck? Looking for jewels. There's a brochure. Finding love with the art director. Almost got creamed by a roller coaster. Turns out Joy did that. Turns out I falsely accused several people. I found a key. There's a booby trap. A secret someone left a key for me that unlocked a door in the haunted house. I was hoping it would lead to Kessler's old workshop. Can I Instead, call the Hardy Boys? It went to a booby trap. Someone purposefully lured you into a trap? You must be getting close to something, Nan. I found a pair of Ingrid, Ingrid's pliers. I found a pair of Ingrid's pliers behind the door. When I asked her about them, Ingrid suggested that someone was trying to frame her. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Anyway, I'm going to go get some ice Catch cream. Catch you guys later. Keep in touch. Keep up the good work. <sighs> anyway... Oh, that's the Hardy Boys? What do their voice what do their voices sound like? Hello? Hey Frank, it's Nancy. Hey Joe, pick up. Actually, he may not want to talk to you. Why not? Because you get to solve a mystery at an amusement park. He's so jealous he could spit. Hi, this is Joe. Hey Joe, it's Nancy. And he usually I swallows. Don't want to talk to you. What did I tell you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Pardon me for a second. I gotta go spit. Quit fooling around, <laughs> Joe. She's calling long distance, remember? Sorry. So what's going on? The joke wrote itself. Um, anyway. Apparently, someone, something, something. Oh. Any suggestions as to my next move? Nothing here. Or here. Sorry, Nance. Y'all fucking suck. Everyone sucks. Nobody ever call me again. I better get going. Let us know what happens. No. And fuck you. Dear chat, I need a hint. <laughs> oh, wait, let me go talk to Harlan. Hey, Nancy, what's up? Oh, never mind. See you around. Go get him. Dear chat, I need a hint about what to do with this brass ring and who... Oh, no, I haven't saved this whole episode. That's a good idea, I guess. I gotta make a phone call to Tink again. Look in the carousel book. There is something I missed in Elliot. There can't be anything I missed in Elliot's studio at this point. The Papa Dada? Oh, the Papa Dada? Tink again? 
All right, I'll call Tink again real quick. Tink here. Hi, Nancy Drew again. Now what? Have fun fishing. Oh, I will. Battery level is critical on my mouse. Oh, hell no it ain't. Plug this little turd in. Don't y'all worry about it. Don't you worry about it, it's charging. Not today. Not this sausage sleuth. How could I miss something? <laughs> Foxfire. The magazine, eh? <gasps> Do I open it up and it's not actually a violin magazine? It's pornography? I thought I looked hmm, in this. If Elliot wrote this guy's number down, maybe I should too. I sure as fuck didn't open this. Oh. 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 I didn't open this? Oh, here we go. Banished history, catches you miss as a lunatic, some of the da 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 I got that. Can you turn it back, please? Does she know how to flip backward? Thank you. Run my fans. Oh! I don't see a nickname. All right, I'm going to call that number there. That number probably knows the nickname. Just as I suspected. Oh, you can't open it to Elliot's gone. My name is Nancy Drew. I saw the article you wrote about Rolf Kessler in the collector's hot sheet magazine. That was several months back, but go on. Well, seeing as you're pretty much an expert on Kessler as well as carousels, I was hoping you could answer a question for me. I'd be delighted. Would you happen to know the nickname Rolf Kessler gave his wife, Amelia? Of course I do. At least, I thought I did. It was an Austrian term of endearment, rather common. Oh, come on, Anton, think. Spatzi. That was it. Spatzi. S-P-A-T-Z-I. He always called her Spatzi. Um, do you send us something horse that was stolen? Did you by any chance hear about Scopa. the horse that was stolen off the carousel at Captain's Cove Amusement Park in New Jersey? It was one of the carousels that Kessler carved. Yes, I did, and I thought, how odd. Because, you see, I'd gotten a call from someone about a month prior to that asking me how much I thought one of those horses would be worth. Really? Do you have any idea who it was that called? None whatsoever. He never gave me his name, he... nor did he say where he was calling from. The thought that I may have actually encouraged someone to mutilate a work of art. Oh. How much would a horse from a Kessler carousel be worth? Five thousand. Depending on its condition, whether it's an inside horse or an outside horse, whether it's the lead horse, anywhere from 80000 to well over $100,000. Wow, that's a lot of money. Yes, it is. But Kessler carved horses for only five carousels in his lifetime. So not only is each horse exquisitely beautiful, but it's very rare, especially if it's the lead horse. The lead horse? The outside horse, just behind the chariot. The place where you can sit instead of ride. It's traditionally the most ornately carved horse on the carousel, hence the most valuable. Just behind the chariot. Just behind the chariot. 
I am now hiring for an Ocean's Eleven type of group to drop in and steal carousel horses. <laughs> Not really for legal purposes, but oh my God, I didn't know they were worth that much. I saw it on Antiques Roadshow. I don't think they said that much. Did you hear about how the carousel at Captain's Cove is now allegedly haunted because one of the horses was stolen? Pulling an Ocean's <laughs> Eleven yes. what a wonderful at the carnival. Piece of nonsense. Do you have any idea why someone would be going to the trouble of making the carousel turn on and off by itself? As a matter of fact, I do. I think that someone wants publicity. Whoever stole the horse wants people to know that it's gone so that when he or she goes to sell it, there will be a whole slew of eager buyers. But we're talking about stolen property. Are you saying people would willingly buy something they know was stolen? We're talking about the black market, my dear. Great works of art get stolen by thieves and bought by less than scrupulous collectors what? all the time. People do illegal things? Nancy just learning that people can break the law. If someone did steal that horse off the carousel in order to make money off of it, what would be his or her next move? How would they go about selling it? Well, the thief would probably get a middleman to set up a bidding war between several buyers in order to get the highest price. The internet comes in very handy in such matters. Thanks for all the info. The pleasure was I'm all shocked, mine. I tell you. Shocked to find out that people would break the law. Actually, livid. Actually, who do we call about this? That's the same voice actor as Shorty? I feel like we should be calling our representatives. Was I supposed to tell that to him? Joy has stepped out of the office. Thanks, Miles. The Nancy Drew entity is welcome. Nor. 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 I'm going to the haunted house. And it's locked. Shh. Did you say use the brass ring in here? Looks like Spook 10 is missing an arm. Oh. I see. The arm is missing. Is she gonna nibble on it? The arm is missing. Did you hot glue it on? I don't know. The arm is missing. Okay, we get it. It's been red tagged. Oh, I see. That's not how take we know the tag it's until called. I fix this. Okay. Oops. No power. Uh huh. Can we look at it? Oh. I thought I was gonna get to look lower. I have an idea. Ingrid, we have an Hello, issue. Nancy. How goes it? There's a dummy in the haunted house that's been red tagged. It's missing an arm. Any chance it'll be up and running again in the near future? Got the arm right here. Just needed a battery. That's one of the dummies Joy Trent's father created. Probably why the circuitry is so bizarre. It works though, so just I have pliers. It. You'll need pliers. Oh. Where are my pliers? Oh, and don't forget to take the red tag. Oh, back you gave to me the pliers. Spy Master Bishop. Thanks for your help. Oh, One she open mind sees is. more than two open eyes. She's hilarious. Okay, I'm going to fix that. It's locked. All right, we should. She needs to start doing this automatically. And is it? Oops, no power. Oh, hold on. Let's put the arm back on with the battery. I need a tool to attach this arm. Oh. I need a tool to attach this arm. I know it's pliers. I thought maybe I had to put something else on too, though. That 
that looks tight enough. Look at those fingers. Oops, no power. I need to take this red tag back to Harlan. Oh, okay, yeah. Those fingers are pornoses. Hey, Nancy, what's up? Could you please turn the juice back on to the dummy in the haunted house that Ingrid was fixing? Here's the tag. You really got the system down, don't you? I'll just flip the switch and you'll be good to go. I'll see you around. Have fun. That sure was a lot of steps just to have to type in. What are we, Spotsy? <laughs> Ooh, the glow up, hunty. It's a interesting noise it's making. Oh. Watch it slap me. Oh. What was he? Is he pointing at something? Oh! What's he pointing at? <gasps> Amelia. Earhart! Oh. Doesn't her name start with an A? I don't know what I just did. Does he want me to go somewhere? Is this almost in game? Oh, it's in a mouth. <laughs> Wait, why is he pointing now? Oh, don't start with this 20 more minutes bullshit. The robot told me what to do. Oh, do I need to put the brass ring on it? If you like it, then you should put a ring on it. With this ring, I do wed. Oh. That must be glory. Uh, these stairs sure don't feel very... <gasps> she should have talked faster. If she was going to say the stairs were unstable, she should have talked faster. Oh my gosh. These must be jewels from that jewel heist. A letter. Joy's father must have left it for her. My dearest Joy, I hope Miles and his riddles have helped you remember how much you adored this horse. And how dearly you love the woman who Amelia gave it to you. Earhart? I found this picture of her years ago, but I didn't want to give it to you until I knew you were ready. She loved you more than anything, Joy. We both did. Dad. P.S. If you want to see where Glory was carved, look for Kessler's symbol on the wall. I could never spend a lot of time in there. Very strange vibes. Oh, he goes off vibes. <gasps> Vibe must check. Be Joy's mother. She was beautiful. What if she wasn't beautiful? What if she wasn't and Nancy was like, woof. <laughs> I should probably take these with me. Maybe don't be so shallow, Nancy. Maybe say like, oh, she was a nice person. You can comment on other aspects of someone other than how they look. Did you know that, so Nancy? this was Kessler's workshop. Oh my god, not that. Somebody's been making reproductions. Or should I say forgeries? Forgeries. <gasps> They're so good. They're such good ones. Oh, let's hack them. Dark Horse Adsinus. 
from Huckster at... Oh, this is... This is sketchy. Two potential spiders that learned about the hauntings. Champing at the bit? I thought it was chomping at the bit. Oh, a 40-60 split. Well, it's clearly Elliot at this point, isn't it? He's the artist. <laughs> He's the artist. See, money thank you for the bits. Die every time you can. I've been trying to. I've been trying my best. Autumn, thank you so much for the bits. Everyone really is sick of Nancy. Play... Oh, I'm excited to play Silent Spy. Thank you so much, Autumn. Three to five weeks is too long. Does Nancy know how to boot up a computer? She sure doesn't. She sure doesn't. <gasps> the wigs. Just as I suspected. Wigs, mama. Oh. What is this weird sound, by the way? It sounds like I'm on a spaceship. Nancy, Nancy, Nancy. What have you done? It's what you've done. You stole the horse, you fabricated the whole haunted carousel. Is he gonna to kill me? Value, and now you're making not just one forgery, but several. You think? You let everyone believe Duh. you're just a hopeless procrastinator. But this is the real reason you're behind in your work, isn't it? Right on all counts. Unfortunately, you're not going to get to tell anyone else. Ever. No, wait. Look what I have. They're diamonds. Real diamonds. Someone stole them 23 years ago and stashed them in the park. Well, well. Little icing on the cake. Kill her anyway. But if you think I'm letting you have... Just give them the That's diamonds. Right. You want them? Here. Ouch. Uh -huh. Hey. <laughs> I've got to get out of here. Oh, jeez. Woo! How do I run? Woo! I'm trapped. I've got to get out of here. I've got you, Nancy. You're cornered. Oh, he's gonna walk in the hole. You might as well give up. What is this slowest fucking wa oh he didn't do it. Um oh, put the ring on it. Nope. Um I gotta go. Oh! <laughs> End of the road, detective. I died. Should I have thrown the jewels or something? I thought I could put the ring back on the thing. Yeah, that was fucked up. That was fucked up. Alright, hold on. <laughs> These are the sound, same sound effects I would have made. I've got to get out of here. Ah! You, Nancy. You're cornered. Ah! Do you I not? Well give up. Good God. We have to watch him walk. I can't click anything. I don't have the brass ring. Here we go. Oh. oh! <laughs> End of the road, detective. Does he strangle me? The ring was still... Wait, I have the ring? Or the ring's still on the thing? I've... Hold on. I got some more ideas. Hold on. Don't worry about it. I got a few more ideas. trapped i've got to get out of here i've got you nancy you're cornered <laughs> we have you to as well give up wait for him to fucking shuffle the fuck is this fucking shuffle i'm gonna die ah! <laughs> oh my god his jeans fit so well here, i'm gonna call the police elliot so don't bother making plans for tonight why is she screaming <laughs> at me 10 years 
She thinks he's gonna Dear get Nick, 10 years. After trapping Elliot, I managed to pry the exit open and had Harlan call the police. Elliot admitted to stealing the carousel horse and planning the remote control device. He knew that publicity from the hauntings would increase the value of his forgeries. Needless to say, he's gone back to not liking me. Harlan, on the other hand, adores me now, because not only did he share the credit for busting Elliot, but his sudden fame brought him three job offers. He's staying on at Captain's Cove out of loyalty to Paula, but he's happy knowing that being an ex-con will probably never be an issue for him again. As for Ingrid, she promptly attributed Elliot's bad behavior to a deficiency in some mineral I couldn't pronounce. And Joy, when I gave her the picture of her mother, she started smiling and has yet to stop. Inventing Miles was the best thing her late father could have done for her. In fact, when I went to the park to say goodbye just now, she wasn't in her office. She was riding the carousel. Ever yours, Nancy. If her mom looks like that, why'd she look like that? I'm just saying what everyone's thinking. Oh, what I win? Puzzle Master, just as I suspected. Yeah, Joy did a crime too. Five four four six eight. I can't come to the phone right now, so please leave a message. Hi, Bess. Hi, George. Well, thanks to you guys, I'm leaving here and flying directly to the Pacific Northwest for some much-needed R&R. George, I just got off the phone with that marine biologist friend of yours. What's she this one? She insisted I stay with her, and she even said she'd take me whale watching on the tour boat she owns. Anyway, thanks for arranging Whales. this vacation, you two. They're not extinct? One whole week of peace, quiet, and sitting around doing nothing. <laughs> this is going to be awesome. Bye. Oh, Nancy. As if. Whales aren't extinct? Okay, I think the one I'm playing next, though, is not Deception Island. Y'all, I'm pretty sure we're gonna play the Shattered Medallion. We need to do the Shattered Medallion or else we're gonna end up playing it last. And from what y'all tell me, I don't want to end on a bad note. We're doing the Shatter Medallion next. We've only got like seven games left, y'all. I loved this one. This one might actually be one of my favorites. See, I don't know when to trust y'all. Because one, y'all told me I would hate Midnight in Salem. Amazing game. Flawless game. Second of all, y'all told me that I was going to hate Joy. Favorite character in the series. <laughs> uh, favorite character in the series. Oh, I'm ready to roast. I'll be ready to roast. Not 20 minutes left on the credits. Okay, I'm gonna... If you're on Twitch, stick around. Um. Oh, God. Okay, if you're on Twitch, stick around because I'm not going to end the stream. I, I am going to end the VOD for YouTube. Um, and I'll be right back in just like two seconds. Um, and we're going to do um, a little off the record Dead by Daylight. Don't tell anybody. Okay. Um, thank y'all so much for being here. Thanks for all the bits, donations, subs, gift subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all are freaking amazing. This was one of my favorites. I fucking love this. This was awesome. Stay tuned. We'll be doing a little something else if you're here on Twitch. Otherwise, stay tuned next week, Sausage Sleuths on YouTube. We'll be sleuthing some more. <laughs> oh. Pretend the music's still playing. Oh, it stopped in the game, too. Oh, no, there it goes. There it goes. Shh.